Okay, stop reading the news. Why is everyone so obsessed with COVID-19 live updates? It's time to move on and spread positive news that's impacting the healthcare industry. Hello and welcome to Global Healthcare Archives by Medvasity. Let's have a quick look at the top healthcare stories of the week. Did you know that treating mental illness is no longer restricted to only psychiatric medications? According to a recent study from Princeton University, home gardening can now improve your emotional well-being because you feel more connected to nature. So automation is the new secret sauce for the healthcare industry. 15% of all revenue cycle leaders plan to invest in robotic process automation, up from zero last year. Automation holds the potential of eliminating human error and also possibly completing tasks at a fraction of the time it took earlier. 3D printing is now everywhere. Now COVID-19 testing can be done through 3D printed nasal swabs that perform just like NP swabs. This will address the demand supply gap of NP swabs. Axial's 3D nasal swabs cleared all the required testing conducted by USF Health Facility and in collaboration with Northwell Health. We're all now obsessed with this new buzzword called social distancing. And as we start getting back to work, it's getting to be more and more difficult to implement the same. Now, with Safe Space Watch and Badge, we can implement contract tracing safely at the workplace. Their devices are durable, water resistant, and easy to sanitize. Using ultra wideband radio frequency, these devices provide immediate social distancing feedback with an accurate margin of error, which is less than 10 centimeters. The Indian firm Medwin Healthcare has launched a product named Shikocan to neutralize the spike proteins that are present in coronavirus. The device is effective for offices, malls, and other public spaces. A California-based startup, Cure, is reducing the barrier to access healthcare by leveraging AI. The GPU-powered AI app connects patients, healthcare providers, and coaches through a chat-based application. This app is designed to connect all the healthcare dots from understanding symptoms to making diagnosis and determining treatment plans. Well, that's all for this week. Next week, we'll be back with a new set of updates. Till then, stay safe and keep your families safe. Thank you.